guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to be reviewing the Sissa Sika Kicker. I don't know how to pronounce it, jelly mask. Okay, so before I get into that, you know the dealio. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't subscribed already. Thumbs up, comment in the comment section below. Would you like to try this mask? Have you already tried it? What are your thoughts on it? Okay, let's get into the video. Okay, so the Sissa Jelly Mask is a Korean face mask and I know that you've been waiting for me to review some Korean skincare products. This is the first one I'm reviewing. Um, okay, so basically the company was asking for some volunteers to try the mask out. I said, I'll do it. I'm not getting paid for this. I just got free masks. I'm literally just reviewing it for your sake and for my skin's sake. You know, I'm just honest as possible. So I wanna give you a full, honest, detailed review on how I feel about it. Okay, so this ingredient that I can't pronounce, Sissa, Sika, Kika, however you pronounce it, it's fantastic for hydrating and soothing the skin, um, and it's really good for repairing the skin as well. Um, so it also has aloe vera, it's got some jelly in it, and it's got Made, Made Cassicide. I'm just gonna zoom in these three main ingredients here and the rest is in Korean <laughs> so we're gonna see how we work through this make sure you have a clean and cleansed face and my face is nice and clean nothing's on it then you apply the mask you leave it on for 10 to 20 minutes then you take it off so we're gonna look at my skin now before so my skin is not okay guys like she is the end of a period type of skin you know she's not that good she's not doing well so I've got breakouts faded breakouts some new scarring and stuff like that so sis needs help we need some help so let's go on and open it okay so inside you get 10 masks so let's get one of them out front cover of the box same instructions okay so let's open that up see so my skin is nice and clean nothing's on it no products or anything Okay, the smell, it smells quite nice. Um, some sort of aloe vera type smell, but it's nothing too strong, nothing overbearing, no crazy fragrance. Very jelly inside, very, very jelly-like. Okay, so this is getting the mask out. Very jelly indeed, okay. So you can see, I can feel a lot of gel, a lot of jelliness. Okay, now I need to open it. Where do I even start? Ah! One awkward thing about it is it's hard to open up because there's so much gel product on there. Like I can't, I'm trying to find an opening, but it's not there. So maybe I can push through the eyes and the mouth. It's dripping, it's dripping. Ah! Come on, sis! There we go, okay, there she is, there she is. All right, so it's a normal like cotton mask that is drenched in the product. So let's put that on. I'm gonna stare at the viewfinder now. So it's always best to start these masks in the center of your face and then smooth it out, okay. Smell the smell quite strong now. Oh, it's very cold and jelly. Really easy to just stick on your face, just hard to open. Okay, so this feels quite soothing actually. It's quite soothing, quite calming, quite relaxing. Hmm. Yeah, it's really relaxing. I could take a nap right now. So I will see you in 20 10 to 20 minutes. I'll see you in 10 minutes. See what the mask looks like in 10 minutes. Then see you in 20 minutes. And then we can see what's up. See you. See you soon. Hey guys, I'm back. It has been 15 minutes. And what's interesting is this has not dried out completely. There's a bit of a dry patch here. Slightly dry patch here. So if you do leave it on for 20 minutes, it will get drier. Um, I have a little bit of a patch here, it was a very dry skin and I kind of shaved off the dry skin this morning so that was a bit tingly before but now it's stopped, it only tingled for maybe a couple of minutes um, like five minutes ago but no sensitivity yeah, issues so let's remove the mask, it's been 
it's about 17 minutes now probably nearly 20 minutes so I would like to keep this on but I have got to go somewhere so I've got to take this off and start getting ready so I need to take it off let's see Oh, that was so cooling now, even the warm, the air feels so warm. The mask feels warm now, but it did feel very cooling, so I'm just going to let it wipe the product on. Right. Oh, what um, the company advised is to leave the gel on and let it settle on the skin. Let's see what my skin looks like, besides jelly. Um, this sensitive area seems fine, maybe slight pinkish nothing really um yeah it feels quite smooth don't worry my hands are clean and i do like how the mask goes quite close to your eyes so it does cover your under eye area because that's one annoying thing about some face masks is they don't cover the under eye area and sometimes that is somebody's biggest insecurity maybe it's really dehydrated there or really dark circles and the masks don't cover it but this one does so i do quite like that um I love that it's an easy mask. I mean, obviously to open it was a bit hectic, but that's not even a big deal. Um, but yeah, let's see if it dries and how long it takes to dry because I don't want to break out. I don't want to have like a thick gel on my skin and I don't want to break out because sis, sis is sensitive like that. Like I will break out if a product is too heavy. I won't break out in hives, but I'll break out in pimples and acne. So. I'm gonna see how that goes. So um, I would recommend doing this mask once a week if you want to do it regularly. Okay, so the main ingredients of the face mask are Madi Castleside. Madi Castleside. Let's Google what that is um, in a moment. Um, aloe vera leaf extract, potato extract, chamomile flower and leaf extract, and lavender extract. So you can smell the aloe vera and the lavender. That was the smell, lavender. I knew I smelled it before, but I couldn't quite place it. But again, it's not overbearing, so that's why I couldn't quite place it, but it smelled nice. Okay, let's find out what maso, what maso hoodie side is, or whatever it is. Okay, it's a chemical. Ah, okay, so it's actually used for soothing acne, inflammation, small wounds, scratches, burns, anti-inflammatory with eczema. Oh, that's really interesting, because I get eczema around my eyes and around my neck and my hands and stuff. So, oh, so that is an actually a really good product for me. Like, I, I'm breaking out my acne. You know my acne is bad. I mean, it's not terrible like it used to be, but this is still not healing from it um, it stuck to my face quite well it wasn't falling off it wasn't dripping off even though it was quite drippy when I was opening it nothing dripped off my face or onto my neck which is quite good this is actually a as you can see there's a doctor on the cover it's actually a skincare mask that has been designed by doctors themselves so dermatologists I want to continue to use it weekly and update you on Instagram okay so I used about this much moisturizer and I'm shook like I've just gone to the mirror I've just gone to the mirror I've tapped it on feels slightly tacky still only slightly but my makeup will stick better but I am shook like my indentations feel like they have filled up slightly and um, because that's all it is with my indentations like if it's if it's like um if I'm having like a dehydrated day then um, they sink in even more and you can, they just look like craters but I feel like it's really smoothed them out because it's been plumped up with dehydration of the masks I've noticed the difference instantly, even after adding my moisturizer on top lightly, it's still quite plump. My skin looks really, really smooth and rejuvenated. Um, again, this is me being 100% honest and like, get it. I think it's really, really good. If you have any acne or if you have any indentation issues, I think it's working quite yeah. well. Definitely recommend trying it out and it does come with 10 face masks. So if you're doing that weekly, that's going to last you over two months. So it will last you a long time. I do think it is worth it. So anything I talk about in this video will be linked in the description box. So don't forget to check that out. Thank you guys so much for watching and ciao.